Yo, what's up everyone? This is Neff with the Braggas coming with another Let's Play of Wing Commander. Let's get started. Wake up. Smack, smack, smack. Alright. Jump into this mission briefing. Mission briefing, Port Headland. Five minutes into the briefing. Next, Zy Wing. That'll be Rip and Knight. Yes, sir. Today's mission is a four-point patrol route. Computer, display Zai. You'll pass through each nav point, checking for enemy activity. There's a field of what looks like asteroids around nav 2. And another at nav 4. The, the, the nav 2 says, it says mines. Mines. Now, remember, you ran into heavy fighters last time. And you can expect more of the same this time out. In fact, intelligence reports that enemy traffic is heavier than ever. And our people on McLaren think they've spotted a new capital ship class. We're calling it Frouthy. If you see it, observe as closely as you can. Any questions? Sir, if we spot this Frouthy, should we engage? There's no need for heroics, Rip. Just come back to tell us about it. Anything else? Alright then. I'll expect to get a full report when you get back. Dismissed. Frouthy. Uh, how, sh how close should I get without engaging it? Does it really matter? Hmm. See you later, buddy. Catch you on the flip side. Peace. Alright, we're actually... WAR! <laughs> we're going out to war. Alright, let's get this started. Alright, Knight, I want you to... Never mind. <laughs> I want you to never mind. Alright, I'm gonna speed up to full throttle. I'm gonna approach them from the... Uh, the port side. And I don't know why I'm aiming at this one, but I totally am. You're done. Alright. Where's my other targets? Nah, I, I, was about to, I was really close to firing a missile. I decided, wait a minute, this is just a jockey. You suck, man. These guys, I don't think these guys have even shot me once. I killed one really quick, and if one of these guys is causing you enough problems for you to be calling for help, you are such a little punk. Oh, gosh, you suck. Maybe it's a winning path, losing path thing. Like, you do bad, we'll give you worse ships. We'll give you the worst wingmen. Because I swear, Knight, how can you get hurt by this thing? It's not even in your general vicinity. Did you, like, crash into yourself? Where is Knight? Gosh, you're worthless, man. Absolutely freaking worthless. Alright. Uh, autopilot more. Field and I decided to speed up, but what? Oh, oh, what the hell? Like, how are they hitting me in the back? Like, some mines fly backwards at you? They're, they're they magnetic or what? The, what the fetch? Uh, there's a fun word. They're a fun way to not cuss. Let's find the most lame words ever and say those. What the fruit? I think I see something in the distance. Okay, um, I want to be very careful here because these guys don't look like they're gonna chase us. 
So, Knight, I want you to stay on my wing. Actually, let me find that navigation. Let's go to the, let's go to the nav point first. Let these guys, uh, see if these guys will chase us down. No, they're not really coming after us, are they? Oh, what's, what's happening? Are they crashing into each other? That would be awesome if they were. Let's see. Oh yeah, they kind of were. Which one of these has the damage? Oh, are you serious? Rip. Ah, oh, night. Oh, gosh. Go back to base. You suck. God, you suck. Don't even come with me, man. Just go home and just stay home. What are you doing anyways? I didn't tell you to attack. God, you're an idiot. I'm gonna make sure these guys shoot you down. Oh, I'm just joking. I'm just gonna come over here because I don't want to be in the way of that freaking frothy. And I got a missile lock on me. Or two. Oh, uh, uh, that wasn't too bad. Alright, alright, alright. All right. You guys have superior firepower, I understand. I only got two freaking mass drivers in a ship that's not very maneuverable at all. But you know, I'm gonna. I could probably take all four of you out, but I don't think I could take all four of you out. And that Frothe, we're having, having that Frothe right next to me. So you, my friend, are going to pay the price. You stray away from the pack, and I'll show you the. Consequences. Or what do you call it? Is it a pack of cats or a board of cats? Or is it like a litter of kitchens. Oh. Uh. And the sound effects. If I'm sure you've noticed, there are no sound effects for some reason. Oh, glitch. Okay. I got lots of missile locks on me. This is not going to be fun if I continually getting beat up by these guys. Because uh, I won't be able to do much ramming if I get nailed by missiles over and over and over and over and over again. Not having sound effects is really bad, man. I know there are people in the, in the, on the forums for Star Citizen, man. They, they the complain that, that, oh my gosh, there's sound in space. How fun is it to not have sound? Like, I don't know if these guys are shooting me or shooting at all. If, if I didn't, like, let's say I paused the game while I wasn't looking at the screen and I didn't look at my radar, I wouldn't even know there were enemies in the area. I'd just die. Like, oh, oh, my shields are down. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, never mind. Uh. Now, this is what you want Star Citizen to send the sound like, huh? That's, uh, that's, I think that's good enough. I killed two of those guys, right? And now these other guys are probably not going to stray very far from that Ralphie. So I am going to leave them alone. I was told not to engage. I still have one more nav point to go to. In an asteroid field. And, uh, hopefully I won't uh, die there. How far would you have to be for them to disappear off your radar? Like 15,000 maybe? I'm getting pretty close to this asteroid field. By the time I get to this asteroid field, I'm sure. Yeah, they disappear. Exactly at the same time. Asteroids show up. Alright, so... My simple rule of asteroid fields... Don't fly too fast. Don't move too much. Sounds kind of weird, but... That's what works for me. Don't fly too fast, don't move too much. If you move too much, if you change your vector too much, asteroids will start appearing in random in random vectors and you'll get hit by asteroids you'll never see coming. But if you stay flying in the same direction, you generally won't get too many rogue asteroids beating the crap out of you. And this is especially true of the later games like Privateer. Uh, that's definitely true in Privateer. You can turn to face an enemy while you're dogfighting in an asteroid field and if you go fast enough 
um, asteroids will start appearing behind them and start ramming them in the back. Oh, what's this over here? It looks like there's enemies up here. Alright, let's speed up. No, these are good, good guys, okay. Where are they? Where are these guys? I can't target them. Okay. It's a hornet. Who is it? Can't talk to them. That's not what I wanted. Okay. Okay. Can I communicate? Alright, I've cleared the land, but clearly I can't land if I'm facing your engines. So I'll turn it around and face your front. Remember when you're landing in these games to, especially Wing Commander 1 and Wing Commander 2, be careful and keep a very good distance away from these vehicles because you will die uh, because you don't know where the bounding box is. They'll just, they'll just fly straight into it. They don't look too bad. I don't think so. Yeah, it got a little hot, man. You should come out with me one of these times. Just jump in the back, man. See how much you like all them G-forces pulling on you. Why do I get this bad music, man? Was I really supposed to take out the Frothy? Nat 4 was nothing, just an asteroid field, easily bypassed. Yep, that's what I think. Nat 2 was a Korathi minefield, tricky flying getting through there. Okay, now let's get this cut to the chase. Any sign of the frothy? Yes, sir, and she's something to see a large, heavily armored cruiser. And she has launch capabilities. She's like a smaller, faster claw, sir. Save the rest for tactical, Rip. Anything to add, Kumalo? Rip's right, sir. The Frothy is one tough ship. Far more impressive than the Bellari. I just add one thing. The Karathi were all over us as soon as we showed up. Fighter cover was high, like they couldn't afford to lose the Frothy. I'm betting they only have a few of them, maybe just the one. Yeah, it's a pretty good observation, Knight. Possible. Let the intelligence boys figure that out. Full report by 0900. So I can get some sleep? Anything else before we turn to the mission report? No? Good. A scan of your recorder shows... You trashed five Kilrathi, Rip. And night came up empty. Dismissed. Yeah, night, you really... That mission is just... A, did, you did not instill any confidence in me, man. I don't like my wingman. Shot glass, I'm gonna need some liquor. Hello, my boy. How, how's about a cool, tall, tall, cool drink? Word is we're pulling out soon. Maybe for the Rostov system. Remind me to tell you when we get a little place I know. I heard that one of the Kilrathi aces is flying around these parts. Go and ask Paladin. I think he's tangled with him before. Take care of yourself, Rip. Another killing at the ace. We must be getting close to a scenario where I must fail or succeed. <laughs> that sounds stupid. I'm not sure. I need to double check the map. Paladin! What's up, man? I'm starting to miss you. Well now, lad. Tis good to see you again. Have a seat and tilt the glass. A hero shot glass rambling on about one of them karate aces. Last I heard, laddie, the only ace around these parts was Backtosh Redclaw. It was back a few years when I heard, had a tussle with him. 
He's one of their nobles, so it's said. While most Kilrathi look at humans as animals. He thinks that we're not even that high or mighty. Anyhow, lad, I was serving on a cruiser when he led a Jothi attack on our ship. He's easily the deadliest aim to kill that Kilrath's got to offer. He took out four of me mates before we knew what hit us. Keep an eye out for him, lad. He's a tough warrior. Thanks, Paladin. I appreciate the warning. Boss man, what's up? Now oh, rip. Join our party. There's a little time remaining to turn this war in our favor. Should we fail now, I fear that we will be pushed back to the homeworlds. But there's always hope, you know. You, myself, all of us can affect that outcome. Think about that when you next when next you fly. It will guide your actions. Thanks a lot, boss man. That sounds like a good clue to not mess this last mission up, huh? Yep, and I have taken the top of the kill score with 62 kills and 13 sorties. Whew, and it has been a tough, tough fight the last few missions. Alright, no, don't wake up. It's time to save, and time to say goodbye. This is Neff with the Bragas signing out. Hey guys, it's been a, an absolute blast making these videos for you. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do anything. Subscribe if you like the videos. We got more coming. more, Much more than just Wing Commander. But I'm not going to say anything yet. I'll see you guys later. Peace.